Hey YouTube, again, I just want to say in the last video, I had a cold and I still do since I'm making this three seconds after, but anyway, um, I didn't have enough time in the last video because it was like 20 minutes, so I'm making this new one because I didn't get to show everything. Um, it's a little trick for the iPod Touch or iPhone, wherever you are, like wherever, if you're playing a game or something, you can just double click on the home button and it opens a little mini player right here. Just start playing the songs. Ponder replay, yeah. <clears throat> and it can work even on the lock screen. You can just be here and double click it. Pops up at the top. Yeah, so, um, what I couldn't show in the last video, I'm gonna start with customize. Because I really like this app and there are a lot of things you guys didn't see yet. Um,. This is where you rearrange your icons. Icon display order, you could just rearrange anything you want. I'm not going to do it now because I like my order. Um, and, hold on. This is number of dock icons. And you could just, like, pick the icons you want. Nine, zero, but I like five. And, hmm. Let me go back to customize. Mm, let's go. Okay. Um, iPod stars. Whenever you're rating your songs, instead of that boring little star thing, you could change it to little apples. It's hard to see, but yeah. <sighs> Volume fill. Oh yeah, another thing I forgot to show. Probably wondering what volume fill is. It's whenever you're playing a song. The little volume bar at the bottom right there. I don't know how well you can see that. See how it's like purple and blue instead of that ugly normal white and blue one. So I changed that. I customized what I just showed you. <sighs> and installer skin. You can change what your installer page looks like. Battery images. I love this one. It's not clicking right now. Okay, these are all the battery images I have. And you have to download the image sets to get all these flames and everything. And I think the one I have right now is one of these. Or the Duracell. I don't know. Hello Kitty. There's so many. I don't know which one to pick from. Yeah, and the little highlighted mask thing you saw here, right there, I also did that from Customize, and I'm going to show you how to change that as well. Come on, it's going a little bit slower now. You just go to, um, where is it, highlight mask. It has all these different fills. That's the one I have right now, right there. And you can just change it to whatever highlighting picture you want. And main slider, mine used to be Pac-Man, but now it's that black and white thing you saw. That's the one I have, but you can get a Band-Aid, Apple, Golf Ball. It has lots of variations, Pac-Man. Yeah, I have a lot of these too. So I can change it whenever I want. Okay, enough customize. Another one is iPhysics, which is probably the best game ever invented for iPod Touch and iPhone. It's pretty hot. Um, you can download level packs, and what it is is like you have like this blue ball. It's really hard to play at this angle too. You have this blue ball and a red square and you just have to get the red square to touch the blue ball by drawing things you can draw a line I hope everyone saw that <laughs> so I had to play at the position I'm in right now yeah and you have all these different levels I didn't download that much but it's enough and you keep on going oh I hate this one hold on I really like iPhysics. It's just like 
it wastes a lot of time and it's fun too crayon physics it's a really easy level and you just try it yeah it's I usually play this with two hands so I have control so it's hard right now yeah so um let me go to a better level uh hmm mambo or mind blow since uh, oops. wow I keep on dropping the camera hold on what do you think the shape? Yeah, sorry about that. Camera's not really balanced well. So, you could just draw something. Wow, I just messed up. But you could draw anything you want. I've been in this level before. Okay, right now, can't really do it. You just scratch to erase. Start over. Okay, I can't really do eye physics right now. Forget about that. That was really hard. Okay, so there. Um, I hope I showed you everything, the important things at least of the games. Not like the high tech ones, like iShare and stuff. Yeah, so I hope this second video was helpful and it pretty much covered everything you need to know about the best iPhone apps. And I hope in the future they get more ones and I'll make new videos, I guess. But yeah, so I hope this helped. And need anything else you know what to do and watch the other video so you won't be lost when you see this one all right um bye